like a ring, like an engagement ring. I was like, oh my gosh, mark my word. And when it happens, I want y'all to come back and drop it in the comments that Ro, God did the thing you said he was gonna do because you're getting married this year. Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. This is Grow With Row. my name is Regina. Welcome if you're new. If you're new, go ahead and subscribe because as God downloads into me, I'm uploading into your spirit so that you can start living your best life in Christ today. God is confirming that you are getting married this year. You are getting married this year. And as I pull up to record this word, I didn't pull up at no specific spot. I just pulled up and I pulled up right in front a bridal spot like I didn't even remember that this I didn't even know this place is here let me show you <laughs> y'all see y'all see the wedding dresses in there y'all see that God is confirming that yes you're getting married this year how the holy spirit gave this to me besides that because i didn't pull up here specifically because of there like i just needed to find a spot that's secluded that's quiet that don't have too much traffic and i could just talk to y'all god said you're getting married this year how the holy spirit gave this to me I was on social media and i saw this one thing through my feeds and whatever and this one picture popped up with four different numbers on it it had 55 11 24 and 35 and whenever the holy spirit is speaking to me something sticks out in like something just sticks out for me and i just saw it and i knew the holy spirit was saying to me pay attention to this so when i saw that i screenshot it specifically because whenever god said to pay attention to this i'm like he gonna follow up with something later on so i took a picture of it so as i'm laying there god said go back and look at the picture look at the screenshot so when i looked at the screenshot i said 35 so i, I saw 35 so i said what does 35 mean because i see the 24 and god's been talking to me about um getting married this year 24 24 24 so as i saw it i was like okay god so when i saw 35 i said what does 35 mean so i looked up 35 in the strong's concordance like the first line when i looked it up was saying proposal and i was like proposal what you saying god god said proposal so then i said 24 and then god said this year so i'm like it's a proposal happening this year and be mindful when these proposal engagements happen it's not gonna be long till y'all get married because god needs kingdom spouses together to do kingdom building so once you get engaged it's gonna happen quickly right so fast you're not gonna have time to prepare to think nothing so god said 24 so then i saw 11 and 55 i said god what what does that mean god said isaiah 55 11 my words when i send out my words they will not return to me void and so i told you that you're getting married this year the proposal is coming in 2024 and it's a done deal it's not up for negotiation because when i send out my words they go and accomplish what i sent them to so shall my word be that goes out from my mouth it shall not return to me empty, but it shall accomplish that which I purpose and shall succeed in the thing for which I sent it. So God is saying that it's not something that I just want to say for fun. Like I don't just come and say things because I want to say things to you and make you feel good. I'm telling you that this is your life. This is what's happening for you in your life. And so when I say you're getting married this year, I mean you're getting married this year. It's a reason why I said that. And it needs to accomplish what I sent it out to. When you were born and when your spouse was born, y'all were created for each other. 
So the time that you haven't been together or still aren't together don't mean nothing. I know when I created you, who I created you for. And so it's happening. It's been a done deal. I know your life. I know your future. It's happening. And so no matter what the enemy comes at you with, all you need to do is counteract it with my word. God said this and it's not going to return void. It's going to do what he sent it out to. And I know a lot of you are like, well, it's already July. When is this going to happen? The whole first part of the year. You got to stop looking at timeline. God can make anything happen like that. But in order for it to happen, you have to take part in the deal. You have to be active. You have to be praying. You have to be fasting. You have to be tapped in to God to get to your blessings. You could be blocking your own blessings by not doing the things that God said to do, by not believing that it's possible for you. And so God is saying that I need you to believe and I need you to have faith and I need you to pray and I need you to protect what I placed in you. And so when I show you signs and when I give you confirmations, it's not for you to take and for a second or a day and be like, yeah, God said this, God said that and be happy. And then tomorrow when the enemy attacks you with doubt, you start feeding in that and going down a rabbit hole. It's for you to stand firm and say, you know what? God said this and I'm not giving up on the promise of God. God is not a man that he shall lie. He's going to come through for me. My life is in his hand. He know what's my future. He knew my past. He knew everything about me. I'm enough. You got to fight back and tell the enemy what God told you and what God said about you. Because it's your turn. Stop sitting down thinking you're not enough to win. You're not bright enough. You're not nothing. You're everything. And you need to start re renewing your mind. Because it's your year to get married. The ring is coming. Another confirmation. I went to the Sarah Jakes event. And as I'm there... Me and my mom was in in the line, right? And as we, because we, we had some snacks and we had to leave and go bring them back out to the car because they said you can't bring snacks in. We're like, okay. And then we went back out to the car and we came back. And when we came back, my mom was in front of me and she bent down and she was picking up something. And as I looked, it was a circle. I took a picture of it on her phone. I'm going to try to see if I, I could find it. It was a circle with a little thing on it. Like a little umph. And she picked it up and she looked at it. She said, oh, I thought it was a ring. I thought it was a ring too. Because the moment she saw it, I was about to bend down. I looked down and I saw it. I'm, it looked like a ring. Like an engagement ring. And I was like, oh my gosh. So God is saying you're getting engaged this year. When I saw that, I was just like, God... That was something that God was showing me that the ring is coming. And I've been seeing ring RNG on license plates. God is saying the ring is coming and you got to stay in faith for that ring. And when she picked it up, she said, oh, I thought it was a ring. It looked like a, like a real ring. I'm like, what are the odds? The line that we came through, it showed that ring. And you know something? When I was on my way to Sarah Jake's event, it was an arrow in the sky pointing directly towards that arena because God was saying you had to be in that room and what she said blessed the socks off of me and so God is telling you that when God speaks to one he speaks to many and God is telling you that it's your year to get married it's your year to get engaged it's your year to be fruitful and multiply and to join with your kingdom spouse this is not no game show or no playing games or no I just want to get married to look cute or None of that. It's to a join with your spouse so that y'all could do powerful things. Y'all got work to do and the enemy's fighting it because he know once y'all join, two is better than one. Two is a force. And so y'all got to get together, right? Y'all got to get together and make some moves. Your, it's your marriage year. You are getting engaged this year and once y'all get engaged, it's a decision y'all gonna come together and pray about. And God gonna tell you the exact date when to get married. Mark my words. And when it happens, I want y'all to come back and drop it in the comments. That row, 
God did the thing you said he was going to do. Because you're getting married this year.